I think a lot of us owe this man an apology. What is up, Finn fans? You're getting three videos from me today. Picks already came out, then you get in this video, and then I think around three o'clock I'm releasing our playoff update video. You get a lot of a lot of videos from me today, but this one is a good one. We woke up seven o'clock this morning, uh, seven thirty. It was released that Kaplow. The Dolphins and right tackle Austin Jackson have agreed to terms on a three-year, $36 million contract extension to keep Austin Jackson in Miami. The max value is $39 million, including $20.7 million guaranteed on the heels of a career year uh, protecting to his blind side. Jackson gets paid. Biggest part right here, right here. There's $20 million guaranteed. Always look at the guaranteed money. Now, the full contract isn't out yet, so when it does come out yet, maybe you know we'll do a deeper dive and really assess his full contract and all that stuff, but he earned it. He absolutely earned it, and like I said in that intro, I'm one of them that just, he owes him an apology. Now, I don't know necessarily if it's like, we need to owe him an apology, because his play for the first, what, three years, two, three years, hasn't been good. But finally, it's the same thing with like Tua Tonga Vailoa, right? He was his play, Tua's a play was mid. And then we bring in a head coach that obviously knows how to put a team around somebody, knows how to look at the quarterback and say, Oh, this is the scheme you work in. Well, we're gonna run that scheme. And now all of a sudden Tua's top ten quarterback. Same thing with Austin Jackson. Austin Jackson is was young. He was raw. He had great talent, great physicality. Missed some time uh, donating his bone marrow to his sister. Came in and Brian Flores had absolutely the worst offensive line coaches year after year after year. Sometimes twice in a year. Finally, Butch Berry comes in and everyone laughed at the Miami Dolphins for signing Butch Berry. Ex-Bronco players or Bronco players laughing at the Miami Dolphins for hiring Butch Berry. But look what Butch Berry has done to this offensive line MVP and the coaching staff definitely Butch Berry ridiculous now Austin Jackson get, has given up fewer quarterback pressures than any AFC tackle who has played compared comparable snaps so this the any AFC tackle regardless of left or right tackle that has played the same amount of snaps as Austin Jackson he has given up the fewest quarterback pressures ridiculous and with his contract Dawson Jackson now ranks 30th among all offensive tackles in annual average value around 12 million now again we don't know the lump sum of the contract how much he's making next year all this stuff but I will say this they saved a ton of money not picking up his fifth year option and then just giving him this contract extension. Now, like I said, and this is the third time I'm going to say it, when the full contract comes out and we get to see how much he's going to get the next year and yada yada, then we really get a good assessment of what that contract looks like. But this is just the beginning of, you know, Brandon Shore and Chris Greer making sure that this team that is 9-3 and three right now has a great chance, a, a beautiful chance of becoming AFC's champions and possibly the number one seed staying together. There's a lot that's going to go into that. That's and this is the best part of this, right? At this point in the season, a lot of times we, you know, we're we're like, okay, we, you know, we, this needs to happen, that needs to happen, but we're always like, hey, we need to resign this guy or look at this free agent, yada yada. This time, I can. That's something we can talk about later because yes, the Miami Dolphins are negative in cap space, but with four easy moves, now five potentially, they could be plus twenty in cap space, twenty million. Uh, even more moves, they can get upwards of more money in cap space. So everyone who's like, oh, we got to re-sign Christian Wilkins, Andrew Van Ginkle, Connor Williams, Robert Hunt, you know, all of these guys we got to re-sign, just take a deep breath and worry about that when the offseason comes because they very easily can generate a ton of cap space 
by releasing like three players and restructuring some other contracts. But the fact that they they gave Austin Jackson this contract after a very well deserved what thirteen games he's played, knock on that wood, um, is well deserving. And that's what the Dolphins do. You play hard, you play your best, you're going to get paid. You're going to you know. He's making less than ter- ter- Charles Lennon from the Washington um, Commanders, left tackle. Do you know who that is? Leno? Charles Leno? Because I have flipping doubt. <laughs> Joseph uh, Noteboom from the Rams, their tackle. He's making less than them. And he's he's have garnered being a very good right tackle. And again, I wanted the Dolphins to go out and get you know somebody to compete with him. They didn't have to, and that's a great thing. And they're shoring up to his blind side, which is even more important. He's been playing fantastic. He's gotten lean over the offseason. He's really, you know, full-on focusing into this, and he's young. I think he was, like, 20 when he got drafted. Like, he was super young, so means hopefully he could stay healthy. We can continue the success, but... I'm very happy with this signing, and I'm very happy to eat crow on this. I want to eat crow on Liam Eikenberg. I want to eat crow on a lot of things. It's better to be wrong and have things pan out than to be right and have it not pan out. So, uh, yeah, just want to make this quick video, give you guys an update on all that stuff. I will see you guys literally in, like, three hours. I got another video coming out for you guys, and then tomorrow we have the preview for the Titans game. Uh, but comment below, let me know what you think of the signing of Austin Jackson. Again, we'll go into contract detail when it comes out, but on that, like usual, stay classy. If ends up.